Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Well, we've got some hot candy to review for you guys today. I'm going to be reviewing this uh, Stung Tongue Pepper Company's Ghost Pepper Candy made with organic peppers. Now this did get a little bit sticky, so uh, I did have to put it in the refrigerator for a while. But uh, let me go ahead and read a little bit about them on the, the uh, website here. It says, we offer top quality, all natural, extreme spices and tasty treats for the chili head and... Scoville Junkie. No gimmicks, just pure heat. Uh, your prescription for an endorphin rush starts now. now let me go ahead and uh, read what it says about the ghost pepper candy on the website. It says, ultra gourmet spicy hard candies are made by infusing our tasty organic ghost peppers with our candy making process. We use fresh chilies, not powders. We sell 100% pure powders. Our methods for our candy production are unlike anything else on the market. No gimmicks, pure goodness. Get ready to fly with this endorphin rush. Alrighty, now the um, it says on the package here for the uh, ghost pepper candy. It says all of our candies are extremely spicy. Expect your mouth to burn, okay? It says it's made from raw, unrefined organic sugar organic uh, invert sugar and organically grown ghost peppers. All right, well, let's go ahead and get some of this. I just love a good uh, spicy candy. Now, as you can see from the picture um, in the introduction to this video, they look a lot better than this. Um, they're, they're kind of stuck together, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and just uh, do two at once. So uh, here we go. Separate a little bit and then so we just got two going on at once here. Mmm, nice sweet flavor right off the bat. The, uh, the heat from the ghost pepper is starting to come on a little bit now. But with these type of candies, the best thing to do, you know, is not try to chew it up right away. Just suck on it for a while. See how long you can leave it in your mouth. I remember years ago, you know those round um, fireballs? Believe, yeah, that's what they're called. Sometimes those were so spicy I had to take it out um, before I could finish it. They got so hot. Those cinnamon fireball candies. I don't think that bothered me much now. Once again, sent to me from Dan Van. Uh, he is grower and breeder at the uh, Stung Tongue Pepper Company. I reviewed his um, zombie teriyaki sauce, which was just awesome, really good product, and also the, uh, the zombie wings, uh, the uh, pepper or dried pepper powder blend that he has was just awesome on some chicken wings. These are not that hot to me. I've had a lot hotter, but it's got a great sweet flavor to it. Not flavored, I guess, with anything like cherry or anything like that, but just the just the uh, sweetness, sugar sweetness. This is an all over kind of um, upper medium burn. Keep them in their mouth a little bit longer, then I'll chew them up. He's got a lot of products on his website. Um, really interesting products. Ghost pepper candy. He's got the uh, teriyaki, zombie teriyaki um, sauce. Maruga scorpion chili pepper powders. Shrinit, uh, butch tea chili pepper powders. There are shipping live chili plants as well, and uh, he does make some purees uh, as well. So if you need to contact him, uh, you can reach him at danvan at stung-tongue.com. Heating up a little bit more now. Very tolerable though to me, or to the average Joe. We probably couldn't stand it. Probably have to take it out. 
great flavor. Just your regular sugary hard candy. But I think it's very unique, um, you know, that he uses fresh uh, peppers in these candies instead of uh, the powders. So you're going to get a better flavor. You can actually taste the flavor just a little bit. I'm going to chew it up now. Of the ghost pepper. It's not that smoky, uh, dry ghost pepper flavor. <clears throat> Growers of extreme chili peppers, makers of organic puree, sauces, jellies, and spicy snacks, sellers of seeds and plants. All right, on flavor, great flavor for a candy. Um, I'd give it an eight out of 10 for flavor on the ghost pepper um, candy from Stung Tongue Pepper Company. And on heat, um, I would give this, I would give this a strong six out of 10 for heat. Um, I was thinking six or seven. It's burning all over the tongue pretty good. Nothing on the back of the uh, throat, but just kind of on the tongue, um, tip of the tongue. It's a pretty good strong burn, upper medium burn, six to seven. I'll just go with a six out of ten for heat. But a great product. Dan, thank you for sending it. I really do appreciate it. Everybody, please check him out on Facebook, Stung Tongue Pepper Company, and the website is stung dash tongue. Uh, dot com. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, don't forget, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.